I need you to handle this before it gets escalated. Like right now. Well, is everything okay? I'll call you back. Thought you were asleep. I had that nightmare again. Yeah. Like 18 months. I was thinking. Maybe we could reconsider. Come on, Simone. We already talked about this. I know, but... Uh, <laughs> this is Will. Is that right? Yeah? Continue this later. Whew. Hey, baby. I will be working late tonight. Working. It's a Saturday. I'm taking the office out to celebrate our 100th consecutive win. So will she be there? <laughs> Don't ruin this for me. Did you get a chance to see my presentation? I didn't think you were serious about that. You didn't think I was serious, or you don't think I could do it? I think starting a business costs money. Money we don't have. I thought we had plenty of money. And I still have my trust fund. I funded your law firm. It could do the same for my business. Fund? Yeah, my trust fund. I spoke to our financial advisor yesterday. He said it wouldn't be an issue. You went behind my back. Not intentionally. I just was curious and wanted some financial advice. What's the issue? It's not an issue. It's just, just interested. I just thought that you would consult with me before making a big move that would impact the both of us. Well, I'm discussing it now. Yeah. But I have to go. 
And I need you to hold off on making any more final decisions. We can discuss this later. can't afford for this case to go to trial. These investors are hitting me up about their damn money. I may be able to help with the case. The lawyer handling the case owes me a favor. I can get him to convince the plaintiff to settle. What's in it for Gina? Help me get senior partner. And I want 10% of every investment. You never seem to disappoint, my dear. Mm, well, the fact that you think I could says a lot. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Where the fuck is he? So I'm gonna have to ask it one more time to leave. You fucking scammer. Where's my money? Is everything okay? No, everything is far from okay, sweetie. Where is my money? You got this? Michael, so good to see you. I was just about to call you back. Don't fucking patronize me, you piece of shit. Where is my money? It's on the way. I spoke with the regional vice president down at the bank, and he informed me that he's waiting for the funds to be verified. Oh, bullshit. That's what you told me last week. I will have your money. Just give me until tomorrow. No. You have until end of day, then I'm going to report this entire firm to the FBI. Yeah. Do a little research on your firm. I can't quite grasp how a local lawyer can afford such an extravagant lifestyle. And then winning 100 straight cases in such a short amount of time. Yeah. I bet the FBI would love to find out. I'm serious. End of fucking day. All clear? Mike! This is Simone. Hi, Simone. This is Deborah from the network. I read your presentation and was very impressed. I have a story for you if you're interested. Of course. Great, great. So I've been reading into this Michael Douglas case, and apparently he was involved in some sort of scam. Scam? Yes, I talked to one of his close friends earlier, and he stated that the last time he saw Michael, he was ranting on about getting his money back. Interesting. Is there any evidence? Yes, there was a folder found at the scene of a crime labeled case number 10, and inside of it was documents signed by a person named Gina. Gina. Okay, I'll look into it. Tell me what you have. <laughs> gotcha. Hey, 
Damien. Damien. Close your eyes. Damien, <laughs> Damien, what's going on? What is it? What is it? What's this for? Your business. Where you get this type of money? Investments, deals, things I do on the side. Really? Really. Okay. Uh -huh. Feed me first. Feed my hungry hippo. <laughs> <laughs> you fixed this? You seem surprised. I didn't know you could cook. <laughs> it's a lot of things you don't know about me. Whose fault is that? Do you have uh, water or ginger ale? Yeah. You're good? <laughs> yeah, yeah, just work. So, I read your presentation. Really? My news director gave me my first story today, too. Congratulations! <laughs> What's the story about? Mo. You haven't told them about us? Not yet. It's been three months, Mo. I know. I promise I will tell him soon. How you expect me to be real with you when you do shit like this? Excuse me, shit like what, Damien? You knew I was married. Man, yeah, whatever. Do your thing, okay? See, there you go, shutting me off again. I ain't trying to hear that shit. So what, you expect me to drop my whole life when it's hard for me to trust you? Trust me? Yeah, trust you. I know there's other women. I see the necklace, the letters on the table. You know, I don't even know why I came. Forget it. No, 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 no. I want you. I need you. I know what you want. And I know what I want. And that's you. I got you. Okay? I got your message, and that was not a good time. Did you forget about our little deal? Any moment I can end your cop career and update the FBI on your little secret. So you don't get a chance to tell me when is a good time. You know, I needed that money for my daughter. <laughs> I know. Fortunately for you, I can get your divorce finalized and get you full custody of your daughter if you complete this one last job one last job what is it my wife I need you, you to kill my wife your wife yes 
She has a trust fund that I believe will be beneficial to the both of us. But the only way to it is if she's dead. You've been planning this. Huh? I will send you her location and her pictures in a few. Keep your phone on. Till I tell you to. Damien, what's going on? The husband.
Such a special day. You knew. You're surprised. I'm hurt. Hurt. You're hurt? That must make me devastated. Maybe even triggered after seeing you fuck another man, Simone! Will, please! See, I wanted to hurt you at first. But then I thought, that wouldn't be enough. So then, I wanted to kill you. Then I thought, that would ruin my reputation. Your reputation is a scam. I saw the fake investment deals you owe over $1.5 million. Mm. Now, you understand why I need that trust fund, my dear? Welcome back, Mrs. Davis. It's Simone. What's going on? Well, Simone, you're in an asylum. I'm Detective Gates. You were found unconscious in your home. It appeared you overdosed on antidepressants. Oh, that's not true. My husband, he drugged me. Are you aware of the fact that Officer Wiggins was murdered? What's going on? Where is my husband? Is this you? What were you doing walking into Officer Wiggins's house just a few hours before he was found dead? Okay, let's try a different approach. Did you know that Officer Wiggins was married? know what you're trying to do. It's not what you think. Oh. What do I think? I want a lawyer. Oh, I think your husband's already taken care of that. What? You. Stop talking to my client when I am not present. No, stay. Simone Davis, I'm Gina Spears. Your husband hired me to represent you. And I know you're under a lot of stress and I heard about everything that happened and I promise I will do my best to represent you. <clears throat> Fuck you, bitch. Like I said, I want a fucking lawyer.
Thank <laughs> you.